Hello everyone. I have to keep this introduction really short since I only got 66, 55 minutes to review a, ha a lot of stuff. This might have to be two parts. But, uh, yeah, without further ado, let's get into the review. We are reviewing action figures, mini action figures, plushies, games, posters, and Funko Pops that I've collected over the past few months. So, without further ado, let's get into the review. To start off, we got some sick Halo action figures. Let's get them in better light. So, we got this guy from the new Halo Infinite trailer. Yeah, it's not really focusing, so sorry about that. And the one that I w was excited to get. We got Master Chief. Sit. So yeah, their bases can connect very easily. Um, it's very hard to do with one hand. So let's do it with two. So we just do that. Boom! Bases collect connected. Cool, right? So, yeah, that's the Halo. Oh, no, wait. They also have these cool guns and a lot of articulation. I'm only going to show you Master Chiefs, though. So, we got a ball joint at the head. Shoulder movement. Wrist. And hand from there to there. Then if we move down to the legs, oops, the actual whole leg itself can move, the knee, and then also the foot can twist and it has a little thing, it's very hard to move for me, so yeah. Okay, let me get, go get a uh, other item. No. We got Baby Yoda, Baby Baby Yoda. Frick. But yeah, these are Mandalorian action figures. But yeah. So first off, we have Baby Yoda's crib. That actually has this little movable part, which is kind of dumb, because it doesn't really go all the way. And then... Yeah, we got a um, Baby Yoda action figure. Nice. But yeah, it actually has a little swivel at the head. I'm trying to make this as best as possible for you guys. Very decent sculpting and paint. Actually very nice. And you just no connect. Just place them. Next, let's do the storm shooper. So we got the storm shooper. Gun. I put Mando's cape on here because Mando also comes with his jetpack. So I was like, and this could be a Commando Stormtrooper. So yeah. They can move that. Hands like that. Then legs. And then the head. Full articulation. And he also comes with his. And then he also comes with his blaster rifle, which, yeah, it's pretty sick. I'm yelling because my dogs are barking, so yeah, um, yep. We also have, next, we also have, IG-88. 
He has full head articulation. Only can move that. He has this nice little thing that can come off, actually. He can move up and down. That same articulation. Just want to show you this. He has waist. And the guns is this one. And a longer boy. Yep, yeah, pretty sick. Next, we have the lady, who I can never seem to remember her name. So, head. Same articulation. Um, we have her guns. And my favorite gun from the set, the minigun. So, yep, yeah, pretty sick. Well, it's a minigun slash Tommy gun. Then last, the main character of the show, which is actually debatable, it could be... Baby Yoda, according to some people, which is outright unacceptable. But yeah, we got his gun, his other gun. I really like the sculpting on this one, though. It's really nice. Nice jet pack. Really nicely sculpted. And yeah. It's just an all around. Great figure. But yeah, that's the end of this review because I don't know how to time stuff. The galaxy is going.